Hey, survival information and motivation. Thanks for tuning in. If you enjoyed the video, please hit that like, share, and subscribe button. For more breaking and uh, news and information that you can use. So this past weekend, unfortunately in Texas, again, another officer shoots and kills an innocent, apparently unarmed person in their own home. This was a little different because he was not in the, in the house. He shot the woman from outside the house, the police officer. He was called there on a welfare check from a neighbor who saw the front door open. This is like 2 o'clock in the morning. And didn't announce himself. Snuck around the back and guess saw her and shot, killed her. Now, you know, things are still happening and they're still bringing out more details. But as far as right now, he basically did not announce himself and shot through and killed a woman who was in the home playing with her eight-year-old nephew and of course they had to mention she had a gun in the house well Texas is a state where everybody pretty much has a gun so bringing that up I don't understand why they brought that up they didn't say she pointed at him and even if she did point at him at two o'clock in the morning without announcing yourself as a person a free person you have the right to defend your home um, that could have been easily avoided if you announced yourself. When he shot, when he told her to uh, stop, apparently it was like 0, 0.0 seconds. Like, gave her no time to say anything. Not even to, you know, 2 o'clock in the morning, you might be wide awake or you might be half asleep. But if somebody is just shouting out instructions to you and you're at home, not expecting it you'll be a little disorientated it might take you a minute to realize what's happening but like they said according to the the footage on his phone excuse me the footage from his body cam he didn't so sad times so let's look at this what do you have for security measures from intruders period do you have security cameras do you have motion activated lights you know coming in candy um, you're not necessarily stopping intruders but you may be preventing them if they realize if you know they're casing out your house and you realize you have cameras and lights that might slow them down and might want to go to an easier target do you do the same routine every day where they can watch you and try to break in a uh, few things to consider and then more importantly what type of home defense you have just in case someone does try to break in and have you practice with it hey you know they say you got to have you know some states you actually have to have your weapon your firearm locked up which doesn't help much if you need to run and get it but have you practiced to run your weapon other than just going to the range and standing still and shooting which is you know it's good to get some practice in have you practiced if somebody kicked in your door where is your firearm or if somebody forced you in the home when you was putting your key in the door and came in behind you how would you handle that situation? Would you be would you, smart enough that you can lower them toward the firearm without alerting suspicion and be able to use it? Or if you have a knife, stun gun, pepper spray, whatever it is. It's crazy times and it's like you're just safe nowhere. No one is safe. Thanks for tuning in. Please like, share, subscribe. As I said earlier, show some support. Freedom Forever t-shirts. Thanks for tuning in. We out.